One of the country's newest citizens is seeing his career goals coming true. In tonight's Eye on Kelloland, Sydney Thorson introduces you to Brandon Spence. Not too long ago, 23-year-old Brandon Spence, originally from Australia, became a sworn citizen of the United States. I love the United States. I love Rapid City, of all places, and the Black Hills are gorgeous. The people here are great, and so I just want to—I want to stay here. The people I work with, the people I work for, the community day I serve and give back to. Just. It's an amazing feeling working, being loved by your community and your colleagues. Spence has waited years for this day. I've been waiting at least, at least five years for it because that's how long the process takes. It's a long, expensive process, but we're here, we've done it, and I'm very excited. It's more than I ever imagined when we landed in this country. At his ceremony, Spence had support from his close friends and family, including his wife, her family, his grandmother, and his mother, Lara Spence. It's just awesome to see him make his way in this new country. Um, we've been here for over 10 years, and we came to the country to do community work, and he was a little bit against it when he was a little boy, but now I see him step up, man. He's just working with the community, protecting us all, and just putting himself out there. So I'm really, really proud. Spence also has support from his crew at the Pennington County Sheriff's Office, including Chief Deputy Brian Mueller. So this is a very exciting day, not only for Brandon, but for the Pennington County Sheriff's Office. And he's part of our family and has been for a long time. And I've known Brandon since he was in high school. He was friends with my daughter in high school. So got to see him progress through his career here at the Sheriff's Office. I didn't expect this many people to come out. Um, so seeing everyone here from the Sheriff's Office is amazing. and just makes me feel great and, and loved and supported by the people I work with and for. So. Spence served as a detox tech at the CARE campus and currently as a transport deputy. Next for Brandon is hopefully a career in the Pennington County Sheriff's Office as a deputy, something he has been dreaming of for a long time. Very excited for him and everything that he's gone through, all the work that he's done, and very proud of him. He surprises us all the time. He's forever achieving and just keeps going and going and going. And I just want him to be happy and to be able to make other people's lives happy too and enrich theirs. It means a lot. Like I've been serving in so many different capacities, finally being able to do what I wanted to do um, means a lot. And I'm just super excited to get back and help more in the community and just work my way up. With Ion Kelloland, I'm Sydney Thorson. Uh, he moved to the U.S. when he was in high school while his mother was doing community work. He started working for the sheriff's office in 2019.